The Museum of Science is an educational and cultural gem in our city. It has inspired generations of Bostonians to follow their curiosity. The Boston Museum of Science inspired my love of learning about science, which I've carried with me throughout my life. The education I got at the museum was a reason why I went on to study engineering in college, and I've been glad to support the museum and help it give more young students the experiences and opportunities that I had. I think science centers have been very good at communicating science, but perhaps not so good at the technology and engineering. So I think what Janis and the team have done have really reinforced the importance of technology and engineering. And actually what's been achieved in Boston has had implications, really positive implications and an impact throughout much of the rest of the world. I love the Museum of Science. I have wonderful memories of visits with my mom when I was a kid. I was sort of a geek, but we had no advanced technology back then. So I am extremely thankful for your advocacy for engineering and computer science education that has helped so many students across the country, as well as here in Massachusetts, prepare for their futures. Thank you for all of your hard work. Hi to our friends in Boston. Uh, from Amsterdam, we would like to congratulate you with 15 years of investing in children by teaching them how important engineering is in their lives. So I would like really to congratulate the Boston Museum of Science for introducing engineering is elementary to the world. Not only have we created uh, curriculum materials that thousands of teachers and millions of teachers across the country have used, but we've really shifted science education from merely science and what students know about science to what they can do with what they know to solve real problems through the engineering design process. Πολλά συγχαρητήρια στο Γιάννη και στην ομάδα του για τα 15 χρόνια του προγράμματος Engineering. Ελπίζω σε πολλά χρόνια ακόμα. Συγχαρητήρια. Congratulations to Yanis and the National Center for Technological Literacy at the Museum of Science for 15 years of advancing technological literacy. I'm so pleased to congratulate the National Center for Technological Literacy at the Museum of Science. Your advocacy efforts are clearly paying off. For 15 years, the National Center for Technological Literacy has inspired and delighted America's students and opened their minds to the wonders of engineering and computer science. We're so proud of the great work that you're doing as co-chairman of the STEM Caucus, STEM Education here in Congress, believe so passionately in the work that you are doing. I am really fortunate to have been a part of such a groundbreaking organization and also one of the most incredible STEM initiatives that have ever been created uh, to move the needle for kids across the country. I was later the president of the chief state school officers and saw other states adopt our curriculum. So it's now a national model. In fact, it's been 15 years, so congratulations to Giannis on 15 years of the National Center for Technological Literacy here at the Museum of Science. ก็คงต้องขอบคุณยานิสเป็นอย่างมากนะคะที่ได้นำสิ่งที่ดีๆของ EIE เนี่ย Congratulations to President Yanis Mialis and the rest of the NCTL team and the wonderful Museum of Science for making Massachusetts first in the nation again. I'm excited to hear about your new preschool and kindergarten efforts. Starting early is essential for shattering cultural norms and helping girls and underrepresented minorities succeed in STEM fields. To promote, push the engineering, uh, I would say, matters vis-à-vis uh, -vis the young generation is absolutely essential. Uh, and it's true, obviously, in the States, but it's even more true in countries like France or even Europe. For the last 15 years, you've really opened up the hearts and minds of children uh, relative to the science study. Uh, and I will tell you, you've done great work, and we hope that you continue doing it for the foreseeable future. Uh, STEM needs more diversity in its workforce. Your efforts are transforming the way that young students, especially young girls, envision careers in computer science and engineering. So my granddaughter and I especially liked the Pixar exhibit. We had so much fun with it. That was great work. So while we're not doing enough in Congress to advance basic facts and understanding of science and technology and the impacts that they have in our world and our lives every single day, 
you are doing that essential work for our youth back home. Together, we are focused on supporting and engaging more young, diverse students to consider careers in technology and engineering. On behalf of the city, congratulations on 15 years of excellence in engineering education. Your work will make and has made this world a healthier and safer place for everyone. Thank you for all of your fantastic work.